What's up, YouTube world? This is Steven again. <clears throat> um, spring break is coming up for quite a few people, I heard, especially in college. And um, TripAdvisor came out with their top 10 list of dirtiest hotels in America. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to read off the top 10 in America. And these are hotels that you all should not uh, go to. And, well, I suggest that at least. I mean, everyone probably would, but... Uh, I'm going to read off the top 10 list, so let's see what hotels me the top 10. Oh, and I'm going to read them from number 10 to number 1. So, uh, okay, hold on, let me get the page up. <clears throat> okay, uh, here we go, number 10. Econo Lodge, Newark International Airport, and Elizabeth, New Jersey. Quan there says 25 bed bug bites between the two of us. I don't suggest that to anyone. Uh, number 9, Palm Grove Hotel and Suites, Virginia Beach, Virginia. Sounds familiar. I think this used to be formerly named the Tropicana Resort Hotel. Uh, it says camp outside on the beach instead. <laughs> Alright, that's number 9. Number 8. Super 8 Estes Park in Estes Park, Colorado. Quote says, mouse feces located around the base of the room. Uh, number 7, Roadway Inn in Williamsville, New York. Someone said, crusty white stains on the blankets and sheets. That's disgusting. <clears throat> number 6, Atlantic Beach Hotel in Miami Beach, Florida. Someone says, probably more sanitary to sleep in the bathroom of the room. And the bathroom's probably not that clean either, I imagine. Uh, number five, Polynesian Beach and Gulf Resort in Merle Beach, South Carolina. Someone says, hold your nose for the garbage smell. Uh, number four, Hotel Carter. Oh, I've heard, I've heard many bad things about this place. I've heard murders have occurred here. It's in a New York City, New York. Uh, someone says the bathtub was full of dirty black stuff. Yeah, I definitely don't suggest this one. I've heard many murder scenes have, have occurred there. Uh, number three, Desert Inn Resort in Daytona Beach, Florida. Someone says they have dead roaches all over the hotel. That's pretty disgusting. Uh, number two, Jack London Inn in Oakland, California. Someone says, had to go by socks so my feet wouldn't touch the carpet. Yeah, from the picture, the carpets don't look that clean. And the uh, number one dirtiest hotel in the U.S. for 2011 is the Grand Resort Hotel and Convention Center in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. Someone said, there was dirt at least half an inch thick in the bathtub, which was filled with lots of dark hair. Yes, that was disgusting. Okay. Um... Yeah, basically all those hotels I don't recommend to anybody uh, over spring break, summer break, winter break, whenever you have to like take a trip anywhere, I don't recommend any of those hotels to anyone. Um, a couple of other hotels I don't recommend to anyone, uh, the Heritage Marina Hotel in, I think it's San Francisco, California, um, it's bed bug city. Uh, there's lots of brown mattresses, meaning probably there's tons of bed bugs. Don't go there. Um, and another one is the uh, New York Inn in New York City, New York. Um, I heard they have like a pet mouse living there that like roams around to like a lot of the rooms and everything. And uh, it's also lots of dust, lots of mold, uh, lots of bed bugs as well in there. Uh, all these hotels I mentioned, I like I said, I suggest you don't go to them if you want a nice stay. Don't go to any of these hotels I've mentioned. This is Steven signing out.